where uh, to produce multiples of three, we can join how many? How many will there be? So we could join eight and one. We could join seven and two, and six and three, and five and four. Uh, we could also join up um, nine and three and nine and six. And we could also join five and seven and four and two. And eight and four. And one and five. And once we've done that, we should have uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Is it nine? I think there should be twelve. Let me just check. Uh, yes, there's more. Eight add eight add seven is fifteen. One add two is three. And we should have twelve. So let's just check that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven, eight. Hmm. Twelve, yes, it is twelve. On a digital digital clock, ten digits are made up using horizontal and vertical lines. How many of these digits have a prime number of bars and are also prime numbers? So let's look at the prime numbers. There's a seven, there's a five, there's a three, and there's a two. The number of bars here is one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And one, two, three. So all of these four. And multiplying the top and the bottom proportionately by <clears throat> two gives two, zero, two over two, fifty. Multiply top and bottom by 4, we get 808 over 1000. And so answer is D, 0 0.808. How many lines of symmetry does a regular dodecagon have? So the, the diagram is a little bit small here, but the, the answer, if you count them up, um, you get 12. So from each uh, corner to the opposite corner and from the midpoint to the opposite midpoint and the total will be 12. <clears throat> the total area uh, of, of the shaded section here while well, using a half base times height the height of all these triangles is the same and so we, it uh, is half the total shaded region is half the whole and so it's 5 times 14 divided by 2 uh, which is 35 square centimeters <clears throat>